Welcome to the east bank of Station Camp Creek. When the long hunters first came to this area in 1765, they found that this was the home of the bison. Good morning, bison. Today is November 14, 2022, and I'm Jordan Beatty. And I'm Cooper White. Basketball season is set to tip off tomorrow night with a game against Rusty. And FCCLA is opening a new student-run shop. All this and more on SCTV. first basketball game will be tomorrow night at Wilson Central. The first home game will be a whiteout theme this Friday, and the Bison will take on Rossby. The girls will tip off at 6 p.m. Get there and bring a friend. Congrats to the Bison Bells dance team for the amazing start to their competition season. Hip Hop State Champion. Let's hear it. For Station Camp! <laughs> Bells finished first place in game day and hip hop at the DTU regionals on October 29th. And then last week they were named state champions in small varsity hip hop at the TSSAA Tier and Dance Championship. This is the sixth state title for the dance team in school history. They will be competing in Lexington, Kentucky on November 19th and will head to Orlando, Florida for nationals in February. The boys' bowling team set a record for a Baker game with 279. Congrats to Caden Harding and Andrew Stewart for qualifying for the state bowling championship. Caden was 7th and Andrew was 18th out of the 170 bowlers. Keep on rolling. FCCLA's Bison Brew will have its grand opening on Tuesday, November 29th. They will be serving hot coffee, lemonade, and tea with flavor edition options. In Honor Palmer's Bison Brew is located in the concession stands outside of the cafeteria, and they are open during first and second breaks. Good luck to the Station Camp wrestling team, who are getting ready to start their season. They recently hosted the Bison Brawl this past Saturday, and are gearing up for their quad match at Beach on Thursday, November 22nd. Teachers, this Wednesday, the Camp Girl will be serving Thanksgiving lunch. For $10, you can enjoy chicken dressing, green beans, mashed potatoes, and pecan pie. ADECA is currently holding a toy drive until the 18th. They are asking for a variety of different gifts for kids of all ages. The donated items will be given to Gilda's Club Tennessee, a cancer support organization. Help make someone's Christmas extra special this year and bring toys this week to Dr. Gatlin's room in room 413. I don't know about you, but all this talk about food is making me hungry. I'll say, I love Thanksgiving. Well, that's all for now. For more news, information, and updates, check out the school website and the Herd newspaper. And check out our Instagram, at SCHS Broadcast Club, and our YouTube channel, SCTV Station Camp Broadcast Club, for some awesome student projects. But thank you for watching this edition of SCTV. We'll see you after Thanksgiving.